All right, so we're looking at a furnace only replacement. We're currently set up for a high efficiency. Um, you can see the base. Uh, it's a seaward um, carrier. So there'll be a modification on the base. And we're gonna slide it underneath the um, A-coil. AC's, I think we said was from, yeah, 2012, so it's eight years old. Um, we do have a media filter in place, and you can see the transition uh, between it and the return drop. Return drop's actually sized uh, for about three and a quarter ton. Looking at the ductwork, supply side is set up for three. Um, return trunk is three and a quarter. So based on that, I, I don't see any gain updating the return drop, so we'll keep that. Um, you can see the three inch piping. Looks like it's got a good slope to the outside. I will have a quick look and see how it's exiting on the outside. It'll be on the uh, left side of the house if you're looking at the um, house from the street. There is a humidifier. We're not sure if it's um, functioning. Um, furnace isn't working at the moment and uh, customers are new to the house. So we'll check that out. It does have a isolating valve on the connection, so that's good. And the pad looked like it was okay. So there's a good chance it'll be operating. So um, if not, we'll have an option to put in a new uh, bypass humidifier at the same time. Um, you can see the gas has a shut off on it. Um, there's a drain uh, close by, so we'll redo the uh, condensation line at the same time. And then hook and uh, transition into that three inch uh, vent piping. Um, as far as access, we can get out uh, through a door at the back and then you can come down the side that's it